I'm Julie and I have Lyme disease. I was diagnosed December 27th of 2004. I believe I've had the disease since 2002, uh, June. And I've been searching for answers for a really long time on what I did have and also how to treat what I have. So I just wanted to share with you today some of the things that I've gone through and as you can see sitting here next to me there's many things that show the journey that I've been on uh, such as you know just all the pharmaceutical bottles sitting here um, tell how many doctors I've been to nine different doctors on countless trips to emergency room I had a pick line that was inserted in my arm and went directly into my heart and it pumped antibiotics through my system and um, you know that helped me some but I was still going through a lot of peaks and valleys and I couldn't find the right answer for you know a cure or even just to stabilize this disease where I could have a normal life again so um, I did a lot of research and um, I have a lot of medical bills, EOBs <laughs> all sitting here um, <clears throat> and through all of uh, these medical bills that tells the story of all the different diagnoses I had. I had um, rheumatic fever with a chorea complication, polymigratory arthritis, chronic fatigue syndrome, MS, lupus, pleurisy, endocarditis, pericarditis, Epstein-Barr virus, meningitis, degenerative disc disease, Bell's palsy, and neuroborreliosis, which is the slow brain processing. You get word recall problems and losing the ability to find my way home a couple times, and um, that was pretty scary. So this disease can, it's a whole systemic disease that affects every organ, every joint, every muscle, every fiber of your body. And also, you know, uh, some of the things, I left the hospital uh, in a wheelchair and had home health care at my home three days a week with physical therapy. And then I graduated to the walker and then I graduated to the cane. And uh, I would get some strange looks out in public when I was on the walker. Um, I am a new person because I have been given a new lease on life thanks to a wonderful inventive medicine uh, with an oxygen chamber and you are basically the drug is oxygen under pressure and I have done about 18 treatments and I still have some more to go but I feel better than I have in so long and I'm getting my life back and I'm starting to do things like singing and dancing and things I haven't done in so long so I'm very happy about that. So I really thank all of all the wonderful people at San Diego Hyperbarics and I just want to say thank you to everyone and I would like to also just please any doctors that are listening to this if you would just consider recognizing Lyme disease as a disease and also treating it with hyperbaric medicine. And that would be hope for a lot of people just like me. I want to thank all of the people at Healing Chambers of America for doing so many wonderful things for me and giving me my life back. Thanks guys.